Uh, okay, welcome back. Um, it's a little weird. I, I spawned back in with my autosave and it spawned me in front of this door instead of where I originally came out, which I believe was stairs over here. Yeah. So, yeah, some weird goop formed in front of this door here. Now I can't open it. Okay, so obviously I'm going to need some sort of item. Oh, so yeah, I forgot I have an antique coin in my inventory with me. Uh, so apparently that's still a thing. So yeah, I commented last time, but I must be able to eventually access uh, the antique coin uh, storage thing at some point. Okay, so there's a box I can't currently smash because I have no weapon. And Mia does not know how to use her fists. So I guess I am going to get weapons here. This is going to be like an actual real part of the game. Yeah, I got an herb. Wow, okay. So the, I'm full in then. I'm, I am playing as Mia. She is a full playable character. You know, I guess it's not that huge of a surprise considering like... Like, I know I haven't played many Resident Evils, but I, I know enough about them just through cultural osmosis that, like, I know that Resident Evil having multiple playable characters has kind of always been a thing from game one. So it's not that surprising that, uh, there's another playable character. I guess I just wasn't expecting it. Machine gun ammo? I'm gonna get a machine gun? Fuck yeah. Except I don't have anything yet. Also, I can definitely hear something else crawling around out there. I can hear footsteps. Oh, fuck. Oh, great. I need to run right now because I don't have a way of fighting. Oh, God. Okay. This is not good. I need to find a weapon. I really need to find weapon. Ooh, I don't like those shadow. Oh god, he's down there too. Fuck. Well, this is gonna be a big problem. Huh. Because I have no way of dealing with these guys. Please don't notice me, senpai. Ooh, uh, fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, wait, is this a safe room? Oh, thank God, it's a safe room. Okay. Oh, I mean, I could have played a little more last time and I would have, uh, okay, whatever. Oh, hello. Hey, handgun. Sweet. I have two bullets. Oh, I really appreciate how that guy's hand was stuck to it. That, that's a cool little effect. Okay. Um, I'm not a fan of what's going on here. Two bullets is not enough bullets. It is absolutely not enough bullets. Oh boy. <laughs> but at least I got a save point. That's good to know. I haven't played since yesterday, so hopefully it doesn't take too long to get back into the groove of things. Get my controls down. Now, I don't have confidence in my ability to take that thing out in two bullets, but... Should I try? I mean, I've got to get around. Ugh, fuck. Okay, it seems to have despawned for now, but it's probably going to respawn because, fuck, yep. Okay. Yeah, so they immediately despawn when I go in in the safe room. I think I've discovered that before, but... I need more bullets. Like, I really, really need more bullets. I don't want to waste one shooting that crate open. Do I? It seems like a terrible idea. Uh, let's run down this way. I know an enemy is going to spawn. Oh, okay. Huh. That was weird. Okay, now he spawned. I see. Oh, fuck! I... Fuck, and my DualShock battery is low. Fantastic. Let's, uh... Can I go in here? I sure can't. Oh, boy. 
Oh, there's another one in here. Okay, general purpose fuse. Let's grab that. Please leave me alone. Oh god, you're out there. Oh Jesus. Oh Christ. Okay, well I got a fuse. That's a good thing. I need to, I need to just keep running. That's all I can really do. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Please leave me alone. I don't know if they can open doors. Ooh, psychostimulants. That actually might not be a terrible idea right now. Uh, it's too late for us, but at least I can let the world know what happened here. I was on night shift yesterday, so I was taking a nap in the bunk room around noon. I was half asleep, and I heard a kid, a little girl, laughing. Or was that all in my head? Yes, the kid was definitely on this ship. I woke up at 19.30. There was some sort of ruckus in the passageway. Drew, one of the engineers, came in and said there was something going on down below. Maybe a riot. He looked pale in the face. He told me he was going down to check it out, but he never came back. Must have been around 1950 when I heard the scream. I went to the laundry room to check and saw Clark being eaten by some sort of blackish monster. The monster turned and started coming towards me, huge shark-like teeth snapping on its jaw. I just screamed like a little girl and ran for it. And I'm huddled up in the bunk room, shaking as I write this. There's a whole host of these creatures lurking in the passageways now. I can still hear screams now and then. There's no way I'm going out there now. And that's it. I've written everything I know. Giovanni Finetti. So yeah. Shit went down on this boat. I'm gonna go switch my controller. Um, uh, yeah, sound and devices. Turn off my dual shock. Go grab my other one. Okay, that should be good. We're good. Fully charged. I'm not completely unprofessional. Oh god, why are you giving me crates that I can't break open? Should I just shoot the fucking crate? Also, I have no way of looking, telling what my health is like, because I don't have that weird watch thing that Ethan did. So hopefully I'm okay. Ah, fuck it. Another first aid med. That's great. I'm gonna need that, probably. Well, I got another door here. Bullets? Got any bullets? Hunting life. Guns for the avid hunter. Ooh, please be a gun in here. That'd be great. Hmm. Life jacket. Doesn't look like there's anything else going on with this. Um, Amazon River Cruise Guide. Beauty in the Black Lagoon. So this was this a cruise ship? I assumed it was some sort of military vessel. Dear Janet, hey, how's it going? I guess half a year or so have passed by the time you get this letter. Life is so boring here. Day after day, just the same old sea. Although there's one thing that's different. This time we have some passengers sailing with us, which hardly ever happens. It's a couple with a little girl. I think they're distant relatives of the captain. Imagine traveling on a tanker instead of a passenger ship. They must be so hard up. I tried talking to the little girl, girl earlier, and her dad shot me this nasty look. What's he so worried about? Now that I think about it, the captain said he didn't even have any relatives. Maybe I'm overthinking this. I miss you. Love, Jim. Okay, so the boat's original purpose was not to transport the girl. So... I'm not sure what's going on at this point. Should I just use those? Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to use these psychostimulants. Point me towards items. Like, for example, this item under the bed that I totally would not have found without it. Thank you, psychostimulants. Is anything in the immediate room? No. Okay. So it looks like everything else is outside this room. Not looking forward. Well, I have a gun now, so that's good. Uh, anything this way? Like, I have a decent amount of bullets, so... Also, I have that fuse, so that's good. But it looks like all the other items are in that, uh, that room. Uh, oh, this works to my benefit. <laughs> That's a great way to kill an enemy. <laughs> or wait, he is dead, right? Okay, he's dead. Yeah, it looks like all the items are are in that locked room, as far as I can tell. I'm not sure what the range on this item detector is. Oh, wait, we got. Oh, that's right, we got the crate in there. Well, let's do it. 
Gunpowder. Cool. So I have a way of making more bullets if I need to. That's good to hear. Uh, so can I, can I put that fuse in here? Looks like I can. Is my thing still going? I don't think the stimulants are still going, are they? No. Doesn't look like it. So let's head inside here. Okay, we're going up a floor. I wonder how I can get into that other room. Oh, hello. Wait. What was that? Was that just telling me about this? Oh, I can take the fuse. Oh, I see. So I can take the fuse back, so that's telling me that there's going to be multiple uses for it. Was there a spot over here for uh No, it looks like I need something else. I think. I don't know. Yeah, I need something else for that. Fuse isn't going to go in there. Looks like it's for a key of some sorts. So I was actually kind of expecting this section to be more of kind of a cinematic thing where I'm just wandering around, maybe dodging some monsters, but mostly just seeing story stuff. I was not expecting to actually get guns and shit. Locked from the other side, because of course it is. I wish I had uh, a few more bullets, but, I don't know, six is enough to kill a couple enemies. Oh, I can go through there or I can keep going up. Let's go in here. Yeah, this, this boat is huge. I wonder how long I'm going to be here. Okay, everything's dark and spoopy. Uh, God, I'm saying spoopy now. Thanks, Game Grumps. I don't even watch Game Grumps that much. Okay. Okay, hi. Watch it. What? But, Why? But I don't want to. You need to remember. So we can be a family. Oh my god, I wanna shoot you. You suck. I don't wanna watch your thing. I wanna explore for items. I wonder what happens if I try to leave. I don't want to remember. I want to just keep going up. I'm probably going to be stopped at some point by a door. Oh yeah, I can't open that. Oh, that's cool. She's got a bit of blood on her hand. Alright, fine. I'll go watch your dumb tape. So I wonder what's up with the grandma. We kind of left her behind. Um, I'm still, yeah, I still think Lucas might not be done. I'm not even sure if Jack is done, or Marguerite. Who even knows? We don't even know if they can truly die or not. A little videotape. Alright. Let's throw you in. So there is another tape. That's good to see. I like the tapes. Test subject E001. See transport log, top secret. Mia Winters. Okay. So Mia is, like, way more involved than it seemed at the beginning. Like, it, she just seemed like an innocent bystander at the start. But it's clear now that, uh... Be clean. I wonder if that's the trophy for getting all the tapes. But yeah, it's clear now that she has a big part to play in whatever happened here. Um... So I'm interested to find out what exactly that is, if this would finally finish loading. There we go. Alan, you're getting worse. Alan. She must have infected me during the too far gone anyway. Oh, he's got one of those uh, health watches. And he's in the red. He's, he's, he's having some trouble. But it serves me right. It's my fault she got out. What'd you do? It is your fault. But that doesn't mean I'm going to let you die. She didn't attack you? Hmm. Her imprinting protocol. I can't believe this is happening. Mia, were you going around behind Ethan's yeah. back with other men? Tissue sample. Tissue sample. Okay, that's the bottle. Okay. Fix this. Okay, Evie. Where are you? This is interesting. We we've only really ever seen Eva Eve or uh, Mia as like a panicked victim, so this is very interesting. Machine gun ammo. Special Operations Division. Director Alan Droney and caretaker Mia Winters. Recent reports suggest that if Eveline remains at her current location. She's at high risk of being stolen by opposing organizations. 
Your orders, therefore, are to transfer Aveline to our Central American branch for safekeeping until further notice. During transfer, be sure to adhere to the following protocols. Act as, parental, act as parental guardians for Eveline at all times to avoid suspicion. Manage Eveline's vitals via the genome codex provided. If the mission is compromised beyond reconciliation, dispose of Eveline. So, yeah, this is like... I don't... This might be Umbrella. That's kind of my first guess, but... This is some sort of, like... She works for, like, whoever created Eveline, then. Is my understanding. That seems... Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot to activate my pre-order bonus stuff, so I just did that earlier today. So, I don't know, I've got my defense coin. Guess I might as well take my defense coin. Oh, uh, what's in this supply box? Oh, maybe I'll leave that there for now, cause I, when I'm out of this tape. Actually, yeah, I don't... I'm worried that whatever inventory I have in this part, I'm not gonna have later. So I'm just going to throw that defense coin back. I, I know it, it makes my defense a little better, but if I have trouble, I'll go get it. Oh, God. Machine gun. Uh, that feels a little extreme, but we need to find Evelyn, okay? Or Evelyn. Or, I don't know how you're supposed to pronounce it. I'm bad with names. Okay, so the, okay, so this is that exact same part of the boat. That's the save room. Okay. I see where we are. So I assume I need to go basically where I am with other Eveline. Climb up. Oh, interesting. So Mia's got some moves. Mia's like, could be an action girl type. She's not a, just a damsel. She's close. Is she? Oh, okay. Interesting. So we got oh, some more ammo. That's good. Can't go through that door, though. Can I go through this door? Aha! Uh -huh. I want to fully explore, though. I don't want to... Okay, that leads me away from her. But just let me find everything I can find here. Cause they're giving me a lot of machine gun ammo, so I'm assuming there is some sort of big fight coming. That seems to be a given. Uh, I need to crawl under there, but let's let's go explore other parts here first. I like that I don't have to press a button to bring up the watch. It just comes up automatically. Okay, so... Wait, this door is different. Is this the same floor? Maybe it's a different floor, but like a similar layout. That must be it. Yeah, I need something for that. But I don't have whatever I need quite yet. What's this on the floor? Nothing. Okay. Can I go in here? I can. I'm not really moving closer to Evelyn, but that's fine. I Man, do people just eat these herbs and just throw it on a plate and munch down? Okay, another one of those. Wow, I really need to do a bunch. But I assume this section is going to give me hints for playing in the present day. Get some supplements. So I'm getting a lot of ingredients. Like, this feels like it's going to be a substantial gameplay part. Instead of just a short videotape. Okay, so it looks like there might be different ways of getting to where you need to go. Because I didn't crawl under the crawl space here. Better check the rest of this floor first. Okay, looks like I need to do the crawl space now. So let's run back around and do that. But there's not a save point in the save room. There. Yeah, so it can't be that long of a sequence. I don't really need to crawl up into the thing again, because I can just go in the doors. Right? Or am I getting mixed up again? Oh, yeah, I came in here through the vent, I went in here, and, uh, there's definitely- there you are! I don't know why I had so much trouble finding you. Oh god. Uh, okay. Damn, I'll have to reset. How's it going? She's vomiting. 
far more in excess of her body mass. <laughs> oh, Crane. <laughs> We're gonna be seeing a lot more of her ugly friends if this keeps up. <laughs> All right. We need to find her and fast. This is getting out of hand. Are you laughing? I don't know. Or are you just in pain? I guess you could just be in pain. Okay, now I go upstairs. I did it. Unlock the secret door. Uh, now I want to go around. It's weird how they built this like it's some sort of maze, but it's like a super easy maze to, like, deal with. So far, machine gun, not as powerful as I was hoping it would be. There we go. Took a lot of shots. Also, this, oh god, this guy's freaking out. Good old ragdoll physics. Or, I don't know if it's ragdoll, but... Physics. Aw, Mia's hand is hurt a little bit. Also, I just saw something going over there. Alright, I'm ready for you. Did I call the elevator? I don't know, here we go. It's flashing one. I was really expecting a guy to just jump out of there. Oh, hello! So I was right, it just didn't happen immediately. I mean, I do like the machine gun. I just wish it was a little better. Oh, I got him. Okay. I thought he was just falling to the ground. Okay. So far, so good, though. I think we're doing okay. I don't suppose I can jump up into that top part. No, I sure can't. But yeah, as soon as I saw it, I kind of figured that was what was going to happen. Um, okay, do we want to go down or up? Let's try up. Oh, you know, we're on the second floor. Okay. So we're going to... What, is S, what does S stand for? Sub? Subfloor? Maybe? Not sure. I'm looking forward to getting that machine gun in the regular game. That's going to be fun. Okay, so that's the way to go. Nothing over here. Well, I'm definitely getting ambushed here. You can even hear the music starting to uh, chime up. So, so I've, I have no actual healing bottles. I haven't found any chem fluid yet. So that could be an issue. Ow, uh, I, I fucked that one up. There we go. So I feel like, yeah. So they gave me so many bullets because it takes a whole bunch to drop them with the machine gun. I, I almost kind of prefer using the pistol or the shotgun on these guys. But whatever. This is fine, I suppose. It'd be nice if I could find some chem fluid. Oh, what do we got here? More herbs. Yeah, see, I'm finding a lot of component pieces to make shit, but, but nothing... Nothing to actually combine them with. So that's kind of a bummer. I feel like in Resident Evil 5 I could combine two herbs to make like a super herb. Which was kind of nice. Oh boy. Ow. Oh, this is... This is not going super well. Alright, got him. I think. Yep. <laughs> they keep freaking out into the walls. It's kind of funny. Okay, I really need a little bit of healing. Um, I'm just going to use one of these herbs, I guess. It's better than nothing. I kind of hate doing that, but I have to. Uh, another door I can't open. That's a whole bunch of those. What do we got over here? Remote bomb? What? 
bomb can be detonated by remote control. Press square to detonate it. Wow. They're really giving me, like, heavy-duty weapons in this part of the game. Wow. Okay. Oh, I hear an enemy. Hi there. So if I put you here, for example, and you came for me, Uh, there are doors behind- here we go. You coming? Okay, okay, okay. Fuck yeah. Alright, I like it. That was fun. I wonder if I can actually put them on enemies. Cause that'd be fun. Uh... Maybe I wasted that, I don't know. Oh, more machine gun ammo, that's good. But that was fun. <laughs> So I wonder, I wonder if I'm going to get to play as Ethan again, or if it's Mia for the rest of the game. It could be Mia for the rest of the game, I suppose. Also, I feel like I'm completely moving away from Evelyn. But it's the only way I can go, so... I probably need to find those items to get through the doors, and then... From there, I'll be okay. There's definitely going to be more enemies. There's no way there's no more enemies. Oh wow, this is a big area. Okay. I wonder if I'll get through this tape in this episode. I guess we'll find out. Alright, what do you got? Any, another one of these doors, huh? Wow. Oh, Alan, I'm really close. I think she's on the other side of this door. But I don't have a key. <laughs> Try to melt down the lock. <laughs> You're on the bottom level, right? <laughs> Check our luggage. Man, he is not doing well. He's like creaking the fuck out. So melt down the lock, huh? Oh, am I gonna use like a blowtorch? Seems like maybe I'm gonna use a blowtorch. Hey, and I actually have a knife. Like chem fluid. Thank you. I need healing bottle thing. I need healing bottle thing right now. Am I gonna be attacked? I'm totally gonna be attacked, aren't I? Eh, or not. Corrosive. Oh, uh, but you know what? I don't think I got enough for the doors. Um, before I open that other door, I'm going to go back and um, open the other door on this level. Seems like I have to pick and choose which ones I open, or maybe they'll give me more later. That's entirely possible, but for now... Let's uh, not make any assumptions and and just deal with what resources I have. I'm just wondering if I'm supposed to backtrack if I want to use these or if I'll have the opportunity to use these later. I might get the opportunity later. Yeah, yeah well, definitely, definitely going to need more of that if I want to open everything. Oh, there's another corrosive. That's nice. Another remote bomb. More machine gun ammo. Another herb. Okay. Oh, well, this was worth it. Another remote bomb. Fuck yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Oh god, should I go? Should I backtrack even more? I kind of want to backtrack even more. But let's not. <laughs> let's not waste too much time here. I do want to know what's behind that door before I call this episode, so... I wonder how long this uh, section on the boat's going to be. If it's going to be about as long as, as the others, or... I, I feel like... Well, the old mansion... Or the original main house was the biggest uh, section of the game so far. Um, the old house slash greenhouse part and, the, and then the Lucas part. We're both a little shorter. Use my corrosive. I think so far the Lucas part uh, section is my favorite section of the game. Um, old house is probably my least favorite. I don't like bug enemies in games. I really don't like bug enemies. She's. Oh. Evie, I'm not mad. Wait. What 
did you call me? I don't want to live at the lab anymore. I want a house. And I want you to be my mommy. Okay, Evie. I'll be your mommy. Just, just come back with me. Right now. Okay? Oh, uh, uh, the thing fucked out and freaked out and then she disappeared. On some level, I'm guessing Evelyn's going to be a bit sympathetic because, like, she's some sort of weird, like, experiment, I guess. Oh, hi. Did you just lock me in here? You did not. Okay. Did you find her? Yes, but she ran off. She's making more friends, Alan. Those things are everywhere. I told you so. <coughs> are you okay? You just worry about getting Evelyn back. Making more friends. She described that as making friends. And I really don't like that terminology. So I can't go in that door, so... I guess I just gotta backtrack now. Okay, so I would have backtracked this way no matter what. Oh, great. Oh, fuck. That's bad. Let's, uh... Let's do that. Come on. Gotcha. There's at least one more down there. Actually, you know what? I can probably just bypass this one. Just need to lure him away from the stairs a bit. Yeah, I can just run past you. Don't want to get into any fights I don't need to get into. Oh, that's a... That's a good little uh, smoke effect. I like that. Alright, how many enemies are there going to be? Oh god, this place is on fire. That's... that's bad. You know... I want to test this out. Can I just put this on an enemy? No, I can't. Okay. I'm in the red. Let's use my health thing. I'm definitely going to want to kill this guy. He's just... He's too much in my way. Now then, I've got... I've just got an herb left, but no healing potions, so... Or whatever the fuck you want to call them. They're potions. They're basically potions. Oh, hello. Oh god, there's fucking more of them. Please go away. Oh god, I just blocked in time there. And I completely fucked that one up. Oh god. Way too many enemies. I do not like how many enemies- fuck, I am in serious trouble. I need to eat the herb. I don't like eating the herbs without making them into potions, but I needed to do that. Oh, uh, why are there so many enemies? I hate this. Hi. No, no, let me in, let me in. Oh, it went up to the third floor. So I guess I know where I'm supposed to go. Yep, third floor. I can't even go back to the second floor, so... Um, but let's uh, go up to the third floor next time. So thanks for watching, guys, and join me soon for what's probably going to be the climax of this tape, and then move on with me in the present day. See you then.